it's Ruby. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are playing a horror game called Cage Face Terror Licks in Every Tunnel. So it says you cannot sleep just yet. You just found a new lead, another piece of the puzzle. It is the biggest potential key to the mystery so far. The past few months have been, wa it been waiting for every bit of information to slowly arrive at your desk. This night, a VHS tape was surfaced. You cannot wait till the morning. This has to be seen right now. It is your responsibility to report anything you find after all. Take a look and see what it has to offer. So, without further ado, let's find out what this game's about. Okay, so it's just literally throwing me straight into the game, uh, which is fine. Cold case document. So check everything on the desk before playing the VHS tape. Press tab for options, controls, etc. Uh, etc. So what do we have? So we have, oh my god, this is a lot of information. So May 26, 1987. Most of these historical sites are to be treated with a bit more dignity, according to my uncle. Yet this evening he decides it's all right to have a little drinking party around this old mine. Um, that was uncovered recently. All day he has be, had been insisting that the locals in opening up this entrance working their way through a wall of spiky rocks and there's still a quite a lot of debris left. It's pretty charming seeing him unwind like this after a hard day work. Okay, I might have to help him resist the urge to have another bottle. I'm sure his work is far from finished and he still has a bunch to do tomorrow. It's been a cool evening and people have been returning home by now. I had to come back to the site when I realised I had forgot his diary. Good thing Phil reminded me of it when I brought him to his apartment. Man dignity my ass. Look at all the bottles they've left around. A quick note to self. Ask Jeremy tomorrow if anyone entered the mine earlier this day. Just spotted a wandering light in the distance when I peered through a small opening between the remaining rocks. Did someone manage to get in and trigger a second collapse of the opening? I am not going to try and push the rocks aside just by myself. Yeah, good idea. Is that a bird I hear? I've been sitting here for a while, just listening to the bird. Don't know, but it sounds so sad. God, it makes me feel a bit empty, if that's the right word. Sweet Jesus, that sound did not fit its shape. If that's what it was, I don't know what it was. That, la that one light was shining too bright into my face to see anything. I could see the shape of a man. Christ, thank goodness the entrance was still blocked. May 27th, 1987. So it's hard to remember all that happened in the split second. My brain was trying to save my skin. I remember the bird from before, but now with the sound. I'm sure there was something else. I've tried to share that I observed there. But hell if I know how to start. Are you sure it's not dangerous in there? Well, all I could say to my uncle, what if something's in there? I continued. He told me he'd be delighted if he found anything, perhaps traces of history and artifacts that can tell us more. I had less trouble describing the situations to my friends, but their response was harder to process. They told me I, sh I, uh, I just should have gone to sleep as they did not let the drink get to my head. Well, as I wasn't the only one, uh, as I wasn't the one vomiting yesterday. I'm not sure what I saw, but that shape and the bright light sure linger as an after image in my mind good news my mate phil despite not entirely convinced of my story is very interested in a journey into the mine he so happens to have a video camera we'll be awaiting the removal of all the rocks at the entrance once that is done we'll sneak in and see what we can find i'm not sure that's a very good idea to sneak in and see what you can find but whatever so we've got a photograph here as well with blood on it with the looks of things um and report of investigation as well so we've got multiple stab wounds to the body the imp uh, the possible weapon used such wounds could be a pickaxe wow okay some really nasty stab wounds there as well um okay so sorry couldn't wait i'll lay some glow sticks find me p.s record everything there's the thing we've got a, a picture there oh uh. oh uh, is that like a guy with like a a mine cage on his for a head that's horrible 
So two bodies were found in the subway tunnel. So police earlier this Friday identified the corpses of two men known as P. Everest and H. Avery, who were found in a tunnel within the Milwaukee, I think that says, subway. The cause of death does not seem to be an accident of any kind, but rather a murder. Deliberate jobs with a sharp object leaving... A jab, sorry, not jobs. With a sharp object leaving deep wounds have been detected on several parts, uh, on several body parts, such as a head, the upper torsos of both men. Investigators have been scour uh, scouting the area following the results of the autopsy, stating that the punctures are too large to have been caused by a knife. So the horror at a tunnel under construction. So a shocking sight was discovered this weekend when construction workers went to check up on the progress of the repairs in a tunnel in Bristol. Three men were found dead, two in which appear to have been the victims of cold blood and murder. There are clear signs of horrific mutilation with a large tool leaving both traces of blunt trauma and deep stabs. The third victim, however, found hidden at the entrance of a manhole showed such no such wounds. Um, okay, so thorough inspections lead examiners to believe that his death was related to inhalation of toxic fumes. It is yet unclear who is behind these terrible deeds and where the deadly air could have originated from. So mine shut down due to deadly gas. Wake is in the southern mind of, I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce that word, I was still unable to continue work ever since the poisonous gas started to keep out of the place. The sudden incident claimed that life of the miner right before immediate evacuation a second person is currently in intensive care having trouble breathing and trembling heavily in addition he suffers from the effects of hallucinations as he daily complains about not being able to sleep saying that recollections of a man with a deformed face stalking him keep haunting his mind could that be cage face perhaps kind of sounds like something that he would be involved with okay is there anything else in this room Right, okay, so I think we just need to play the tape, I believe. June 13th, 1987. We just need to stick it in there and watch. I wonder if this is just kind of a game where you watch what happens and it kind of unrolls in front of you or whether you actually get to interact with something. So if this is the mine entrance, the looks of things, it looks pretty darn creepy. Do I move anything here? Oh, I can look around. So there's a bottle down there. Um some other kind of like rubbish like oh my god I can move right okay it's put me straight in oh this is awful I don't like mines and stuff they creep me out this is not good for me I can't run either it's kind of cool that I'm playing as part of the videotape itself though I really don't want to see the guy with the cage face because that would upset me a lot I can't believe he talked me into doing this yeah, neither can I. Oh, we can run. Sorry, I was pressing the wrong button. I don't like this. We shouldn't be going down here all by ourselves. What is that? Oh, do I go down the down there? Or do I go where the where they? I, I suppose I best go where the lights are, right? I'd rather have it lit up than completely dark. So. Do I get that lamp at least? Can I not intro? Oh, that's the pickaxe. So was that the pickaxe that was used? There doesn't look like there's any blood on it though, but there is a pickaxe there, so that's interesting. So the murder weapon is still under here. Well, I suppose we'll just carry on dark down the dark path then. Oh, another green light in the distance there. Oh. That was weird. I, I heard something. I don't know what that was. So there's another hall down there. Oh. Okay. And there's like these carriages here. Oh, this is awful. I really don't like this. There's something very, very unnerving about this game. And I, I know obviously like I thought I saw something then. I can hear something now. I don't know, it's very, very unnerving. That's all blocked off, so we just gotta follow the green lights down this way. It's gonna be hard to get out of if anybody attacks me. Which I really hope don't, but we know full well that they will. Oh, there's another entrance down here. 
Plus, the thing is about Underground as well that really freaks me out. Not just that it's dark and horrible, but the fact of, like, if it caves in, you ain't... You're not getting out. You're not surviving that. Do you know what I mean? I just don't like it. Like, everything about the catacombs and stuff, anything underground really scares me. Right, which way do I... Is that just a dead end? Yeah, that's just a dead end. Right, we'll go down this way then. I'm gonna get killed by a pickaxe man. Oh, oh. whoa. Is, is the head? Yeah. Another body. What is that? Oh, God. I should... I'm getting the hell out of here. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. I don't know if I should have took the camera that was in his hand or whether we should just leave, but he did say get the hell out of here, so I am not going to question it twice. I am leaving. It's a one-way system here, though. Oh, my God. It's a one-way system here, though, so I, I've only got this way to go. It's air. It's hard to breathe. Yeah, well, I told you you should have come in here on your own, stupid. I know this is a videotape, so I'm playing, I'm literally- oh, 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 no! What am I supposed to do? I don't like that sound, I don't like that sound, I don't like that sound, I don't like that sound. Oh my god, I'm gonna like... How am I supposed to get out right now? I don't have a weapon! I'll just keep running up here, I've had to do like a... Oh my god. I can hear him. I can still hear him, I think, behind me. Or is he stopped? I don't know. I'm not turning around to see Mr. Cageman head. Not a chance in hell. What's he doing just living down here? Like, how does he eat or anything? Or get any food, you know? I don't think he's following me anymore. But I can hear, like, a sound like a pickaxe. Maybe he's chasing me with a pickaxe. I don't know. <laughs> How's he done that? How am I supposed to get away from him? I'm gonna do this that 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 again. Is there more than one? I don't know. I don't know if there's more than one or if he just keeps appearing in front of me. Oh my god! Oh. Oh, I hate it. I really hate it. Oh, I feel like he's really close to me. I'm gonna die. I feel like I'm running out of oxygen. I thought that was a dead end then. Oh my God. How am I supposed to get out of here? I came really far. I hate this, run faster. I don't care if you're running out of oxygen. You're gonna die. You're either gonna die of no oxygen or die from a pickaxe man. So, jog on. I hate this, I hate it. I see another lie, I don't know if it's him. He's still behind me, I can hear him. It's all blocked off, what do I do? Oh God, okay. Well, that was more stressful than what I thought it was gonna be. Oh, hello. Hey, Ending A escaped. You're calling right on time, just as I finish watching the tape. No wonder the guy turned out the way he is now. Perhaps I can interview him. No. Anyway, looks like I have enough material for my new story. It might even have a name. I like the music. The music's very nice indeed. Ooh, so we escaped. We escaped. Very nice, very nice. I enjoyed that actually. I like the thought that he was a reporter and he was watching the videotape, but obviously we were playing it and that's supposed to have been the events that happened. That you could have more than one possible ending. Obviously the other one you probably die by, Mr. Pickaxe Man, Mr. Cage Face. Um, I enjoyed that a lot. I will put the link for this game in the description down below if you want to play that for yourself. If you enjoyed the video today, please leave a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!